<laughs> Welcome to GTV Studios. Now, Will is not with me at this moment. Yeah, to go. Uh, anyway, so today we are going to be like melting candy, and it's going to be really fun. But remember, do not try this at home. I have medical personnel on the ready. <laughs> um, <laughs> just don't try this at home. I don't want anybody to get hurt because this is kind of dangerous. So you can tell by the flames. All right, come on. Say the guys on, come on. Mint, and the first thing that we are going to be melting is this little, this little, bu this little bunch of M&Ms. Let's open it up and see. Okay, uh, I didn't quite open the bag <laughs> large enough. There we go. Here we go. There we go, and that is all of them. I don't think anyone will really do it very much. Not right now, at least. I just like tap them a little bit, and they like crack. That's so weird. I think they've gotten to a point where it's just incredibly hot, and it's just like, look at how look at how easy they crack. Look at all the chocolate. Oh. Look at this. Look at how easily it cracks. Look at all this chocolate. Look, some of them are even just cracking on their own. Oh, this red one's moving right here. Look at that red one. Oh, they're melting. Look at it. these ones melt. <clears throat> like all the hard, all the hard outer layer is like, like gone. Well, oh, it's smoking. Oh, it's smoking. It's smoking. Oh crap! Turn oh down. Oh my turn god! Turn Hello. <laughs> Don't mind us. It's cooking some fresh M&M's. <laughs> White. We need it not to burn the house down. <laughs> right. Oh, do you smell that? Yeah, it smells like chocolate. Duh. Like when you like burn a s'more for way too long. That's kind of what it smells like right now. Look. All of the outer layer has melted down, so it kind of just looks like a bunch of chocolate right now. I didn't know that they would melt that fast. I thought that it would take a while. Apparently not. Apparently, M&M's melt, or not melt, just remove the outer layer relatively fast. And those were our M&M's. Alright, so next we're going to be doing York. It's actually a pretty big thing. I, I usually don't ha I usually have the smaller versions. I didn't know they actually came like that. I don't know if that's a regular version or not. But yeah, we're going to be doing this version of your you, your, you can still see some of the M and M in the background. But let's do this. Let's see how the uh, York will react to the heat. And uh, yeah, sorry about the fan because we just need to have fan on, you know. So sorry if it's a little bit noisy because of that. But it's starting. Oh wow! Look at that! I just slid it in some of this residue from the inside. Yeah, that kind of mint part of it. It's very easy to slide now. Oh, look at that! I just flipped it. Look, you can see how there's not very much of layering on the bottom. And there actually, I think there's a lot of it at the top. All right, I'm gonna try to cut it in half. Wow, that's crazy. Look at that. Look at all that splits in half. It was actually really easy. I just kind of didn't want to break the kind of chocolate coating that it has on the top. Oh, there's smoke coming out. Look at all of that. All the mint is, is the one that's really uh, ho, ho. making it going. Oh my gosh. This is what happens when a York gets melted. That is crazy. And it's already bubbling up. Wow, that is insane. Wow, look at that consistency. That's crazy. All right, let's turn it off before things get a bit too crazy. Are you ready for the grand finale? <laughs> Melting all of the candy. <laughs> So, this is the grand finale. We are melting all of the candy that we have. It's all right here. We're going to be melting it all, and I'm going to have a little taste of it, just to see 
how chocolatey or how candy or how la 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 it gets. By the way, la la is a flavor, don't worry. All right, so we got some, we got some Kit Kat, a hard grain, Starburst, M&Ms, and York all going to be melting right here. All right, hashtag not sponsored by any of these. Don't get the wrong idea. <laughs> all right, so first one going in, the 100 grand. And now we're gonna start it. So the 100 grand's on it right now. Now we're putting our second, our second York of the day. We know that it bubbles up very fast. Got that right there. We got some Kit Kat right here. More Kit Kat. Oh, and by the way, that's gonna make people laugh. I don't know how to open Kit Kat. Right when I like put my hand like right here, I can already feel the heat. It's getting pretty hot in here. Oh. oh, that's hot. That's hot. Oh, <laughs> that's hot. That's hot. Now we're dumping some Skittles. There we go. Swish these around a little bit. Oh, you can see definitely some coating is starting to come off of some of these. Look at that Starburst, dude. That Starburst is staying strong. I don't think this one's gonna melt, but you know, anything can happen. And sorry again about the fan. It might be a little bit louder as we go into this, but you know, um, this is kind of crazy, so <laughs> we kind of need, need a fan. And now the final thing going in is this orange Starburst. We're gonna see how the Starburst last, last out of all of these, because I'm pretty sure they're not going to burn. But, you know, anything can happen. All right, now all of the candy is in here. I'm gonna put on my safety mitt just so that I don't get burned in the process or it hurt. Let's see. Look, you can already see some of coating, all of the coating of the 100 grams are really coming off. The Kit Kats have all, mostly all split apart. And you can kind of see the wafers on the Kit Kats there, or at least some of them. It's actually looking fairly colorful because of all the M&Ms, Starbursts, and Skittles. But the 100 Grand, York, and the Kit Kats are making it pretty chocolatey. Not to mention the mint from inside the York. Oh, that must be the Starburst, or that must be the Skittles. Cause look, the inside of it. The inside is completely dry. Was white, I don't know where. Oh here, right here's one. You kind of see that white a little bit? That's the inside of a Skittle. Oh no, the pan's starting to bubble. <laughs> the pan is starting to bubble. I don't know what that's from. That could be from the 100 grand. That could be from the Kit Kats because their coating is almost completely off. Oh, you can kind of see some of the Starburst is actually melting. Whoa. I did not think that the Starburst is going to melt, but apparently it is at a surprisingly alarming rate too. That's oh, crazy. God. This is actually looking. Pretty, I don't even know. Dandy. Dandy, correct. Wow. I did not think when he melted all of these candies that it would be like this. Wow, that smells very burnt, I gotta be honest. We're turning on the fan a little bit more because it's getting pretty crazy in here. Oh, the Kit Kats are burnt. Look at that, that's a Kit Kat right there. You see that? That's burnt. I have never seen a burnt Kit Kat before. Look at that. It almost looks like pancake batter, or some sort of ba batter. Almost like pudding, maybe? Could be like pre-pudding. Oh, whoa, look at that. That's a Kit Kat. It hasn't been hit at all by like any of the fudge. Not even fudge, just crazy chocolateness. All right, well, I think that's going to be it. I think we're gonna turn the uh, turn it off. Maybe turn the fan on a bit more, and we're gonna see how this tastes. That seems appetizing. 
yet disgusting at the same time. <laughs> Alright, well, this is really hard. Oh, it's like I'm like, chipping like a rock or something. It's crazy. I guess it's actually a little bit soft in some places, but I feel like the Skittles have really, like, made it, like, kind of hard and stuff. Look at that, it's pretty crazy. It's almost as if, like, we just, like, took a bunch of candy and, like, melted it all up. Well, I guess that's kind of what we did, but... <laughs> anyway, look at how that crunches. Oh, it's so weird. Oh, I don't understand that. All right, I'm gonna take a little, little partial of it. <laughs> when you're trying to cut something with a spoon, just getting a little lick out of it, it tastes very burnt, like very. Still tastes very burnt. All right, uh-huh. Mm, it's a little bit hot. I'm just gonna take a little bit. Like as hard as a rock. It's like a chip. It's that very burnt. It just is like, <coughs> it just tastes like a bunch of burnt chocolate made into like potato chips. And apparently they have to be as hard as a rock. It's such a weird flavor. Oh, I don't like that. That was, mm, that was still not very good. It just seems very burnt. That's, that's, that's the only bad part about it. Look at how frozen it is now. It's like. <laughs> oh my gosh, that was crazy. Well, I guess that's her <laughs> melting a bunch of candy video kind of experiment, I guess. I don't really know. Oh, wow. Huh. Well, if you guys enjoyed, be sure to drop a like, comment, subscribe, and share. Turn on post notifications. And, um, yeah, I suggest not trying this for two reasons. One, it's very dangerous, as you can tell we had that fan on for a while. And two, it just tastes bad. And there's no reason to try it. But, uh, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys later. Bye.